Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. In this video, we will learn about the another important concept in the HTML that is creating the hyperlinks. So what is this creating the hyperlinks? Let's try to see in this video. Hyperlinks are one of the most exciting innovations the web has to offer. They have been a feature of the web since the beginning and are what makes the web a web actually. So these are the most important thing and also the exciting innovations in the web. So this make this has been a feature of the web since the beginning it seems. Hyperlinks allow us to link documents to other documents or resources. So link to specific parts of documents or make apps available to a web address. Almost any web content can be converted to a link. So that means any web content means h for tag or p tag or div tag anything. So any element, any content can be converted to a link. So that when click or otherwise activated, the web browser goes to another web address. So whenever you click on that link, the content which has an anchor link, hyperlink. So when you click on that one or otherwise activated, the browser goes to the another web address. A basic link is created by wrapping the text or other content inside an A element. So this is the thing you need to understand. And also we need to use the href attribute. Okay. Also known as hypertext reference. So this is called as hypertext reference or target that contains the web address. So now if you want any text or content that uh, that sh uh, you want to go, uh, have with this one to go to the another web address means so you need to wrap that content in an anchor element and you need to give an attribute of href that is nothing but hypertext reference or target we can say sometimes so that contains the web address or nothing but a url also we can say it let's see the example of this one so we here we have a paragraph and here i am creating a link to so here a href href is equal to so this is the web address https www.google.com and the google home page so here like this you will be able to see so this is how we will be creating the hyperlink another attribute you may want to add to your links is the title apart from the href attribute another attribute you need to link uh, you need to add it is the title this title contains ed additional information about the link such as which kind of information the page contains or things to be aware of a website. So this title gives you some additional information about the link. So if you hover the, on the link, it will give you some additional information. Whatever the information that you have been written in the title, it will give you, it will show you in the tooltip. So for example, here, this is how we will be adding the title attribute to an anchor link. Let's try to see. This is a paragraph element. I am creating a link to a href www.webdev.org don't think that this website exists so this does not exist just have added it for reference so href this is the web address or the url and the title the best place to find more information about the leela web dev and here this is a content so for this content we have added a hyperlink to this one and also we have added the title whenever you whenever the people hover the hover the mouse into the, onto the leela web dev we will be able to see the title. So this is this title will be displayed as a tooltip. This gives us the following result and hovering over the link displays the title as the tooltip. So whatever we have discussed, right? Whenever we mouse over the, uh, on the, on the anchor link, it will show the title, whatever the title you have written, the text, it will show it as a, on a tooltip. As mentioned before, almost any content can be made into a link. So any, any, almost any content can be made onto a link, even block level elements also. We know we have already discussed about these block level elements and inline level elements at the starting of this video only. Starting of this, not this video, starting of this course. So any content we can do, if you have an image, for example, let's say that if you have an image, you may, you want to make it into a link. You can use the anchor element and reference the image file with the image tag. So if you want to, Make the image also into a hyperlink means you can wrap the image element with the anchor element. And we will see the practical implementation of this one, how we can do it. So this is how it will be the element, the HTML structure will be. If you want to give the 
hyper link uh, link to the image image element href href is the attribute for the anchor element so this is the google.com and img so i am giving a source google image.png and alt is google logo alt means nothing but whenever the image is not there so it will show the text instead of the image so google home page so this is how we will be using the basic thing in uh, for the anchor links let's try to see the implementation of this one so for example here let's go to this one and here i am creating a new file so this is the links.html i am creating a new file this is the html5 i am writing now we need to have a link right so here i can write that uh, this is the link to the google google home page okay so this is a common text so this is a paragraph text let's try to see the output for this one i am opening this one with the live server so if i open here you will be able to see the text appearing that is this is the link to the google home page now i want to give link to this google so that anybody user clicks on this google google text it need to move to the google google home page let's try to write the code for this one so here what i am trying to do is for this google so now whenever the user clicks on this one we need to go to that page right so this need to be wrap wrapped on a anchor link so this google total open a tag and close a tag and for this one i need to give href attribute so now href attribute i am giving so this is nothing but https www dot google dot com okay so this is thing a href is equal to google dot com and google home page we can give it now let's try to see the output so if you try to see the output here so now you will be able to see some blue ka violet color the text have color has been changed now if you click on this one so what it will try to do is the web page will move to the specified address that is mentioned in the href attribute so this is the page that has been added in the href attribute now when you hover here so we are not able to see about the description of about the description the title of this anchor link so if you want to add that one what you need to do is here i can add title is equal to so google home page link or something like this i have i can give so this is the title that that will be displayed for this one so for example if i try to see the output and if you hover here you will be able to see that as a tooltip that google home page link okay this is how the basic thing we will be adding the anchor link or otherwise hyperlink to a particular text content in the present in the paragraph element now another thing what we have learned is we have learned also another one that is nothing but adding the hyperlink to the image element also let's try to see that one so p element i am giving and here i can use the image let's try to take some image something like that so here i can write something like uh, small images google i can use something like this let's see it in here mm, i will try to use this one okay open image in new tab oh very big this one um, what i can say so can't we use small thing uh, let's take the tools here size i am going uh, let's take it as icon okay i will try to open it in a, open a new image tab okay these are all are in the base 64 let's try to take this one or otherwise open image in new tab oh this one is also not nice so i will try to open this one open image in new tab oh, these are all very big i think let's try to see once again here we can take this image something like google maps image now i am i am copying this url now i let's place to in the source here i am placing this one now i can add okay now this is an image and here i can wrap it with the anchor link for this image href is equal to i can use https google.com slash maps i can use like this and we can move to uh, we will see the output first so let's try to see the output here if i try to see the output here we'll be able to see the image and for this image if i try to click here it will move to the google maps so we are able to see the google maps now what i want to try to show you is we can also add the 
title for this one so title is equal to google maps or something like this okay otherwise for image tag also you can add it. it's not a problem so let's try to see here you'll be able to see the google, google maps so this is how we will be adding the hyperlinks we will be creating the hyperlinks for the text content and also for the images hope you understood about this hyperlink the basic concepts if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you